important is it for a web developer to know data structures and algorithms? Well, first of all, if you've just started to learn web development, it's not the primary thing to learn. Start with basics and work on your major skills. Don't worry about that stuff unless you need it for an interview. After getting the skills and practicing them on a real-world project, you can start learning data structures and algorithms and you are going to see how you can use them and that's going to benefit you, as you'll be able to actually use this knowledge and practice. This will expand your abilities and make your job more efficient, productive and easier. Even if you're a front-end developer, knowledge of linked lists, hash tables, stacks and queues, trees and graphs are valuable. But don't just read about them, take the time to implement them, so that you'll know when to use which data structure and compute the CPU and memory cost of your code. But let's make a definition what is considered to be a data structure and what is an algorithm. An algorithm is simply a set of logical instructions for carrying out a predefined task, like finding a particular product, for example. A data structure is just a collection of data organized in a particular way, so that we can perform computational operations on its data effectively. Algorithms can teach you to think about edge cases and how to handle them more elegantly. With experience in writing complicated algorithms, it would be easier for you to write cleaner code and be better at problem solving. If you are working on a small project static website, knowledge of algorithms and data structures are not needed. But in case it is a large-scale website, this knowledge would be definitely helpful for better performance and code reviews. Another thing is a job interview. Knowing this stuff is really important when it comes to getting a job. The majority of tech companies will expect you to know this stuff and be able to code up the solutions to the presented problem. To pass the interview successfully, you would definitely need to dedicate time to studying data structures and algorithms. They are just one small piece in the puzzle, but it is easy to grasp it, and it would only be a benefit for you to know them. Please write in comments why you've decided to become a web developer and what topics you are interested in. And if you want to be the first to watch such free educational videos, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Have a good week and see you next Tuesday.